Hey guys, it's John and Wrestling Talking in the Shop. I'm going to hop on here today and do uh, Today in Wrestling History for February the 27th. On this day in 2000, WWE's No Way Out pay-per-view took place in Connecticut. The main event saw uh, the retirement of uh, legendary wrestler Cactus Jack Mick Foley after a loss to Triple H in a Hell in a Cell match for the WWE Championship. On this day in 2001, Stacey Carter, a.k.a. The Cat, was released from WWE for undetermined reasons. As a direct result, her husband, Jerry the King Lawler, quit his role in the company, ending his eight-year run. However, he would return in November of the same year after separating from Carter. <clears throat> On this day in 2014, NXT arrival took place at Full Sail University in Florida. This was the first ever live event to be broadcast on the WWE Network in the main event, Neville Pac defeated Bo Dallas in a ladder match to win the NXT Championship. On this day in uh, 2014, shooter Billy Robinson passed away as a result of natural causes at the age of 75. On this day in 2020, WWE Super uh, Showdown took place in uh, Saudi Arabia, Arabia. The main event saw uh, WWE Hall of Famer uh, Goldberg Hand the Fiend his first pinfall loss uh, to win the WWE Universal Championship. On this day in 2021, AEW Revolution was originally scheduled to take place. However, it was pushed back a week so it didn't clash with uh, a boxing match <laughs> between Saul Alvarez and, uh, I can't even pronounce that guy's name. Uh, but anyway, it was pushed back. And yeah, you don't want those. You don't want those kind of two conflicts. You know, they don't want to be battling for pay per view buys. But anyways, guys, that's gonna wrap it up for uh, today in wrestling history. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell.